Hey guys, Mark McKay here talking about my favorite pedal I've ever played from Seymour Duncan. This pedal means a lot to me. It's, uh, I use it on probably every song I play live in some capacity, and I've recorded with it on every album I've done. Being a country music artist, uh, overdrive and crunch is so, so, so important to the tone. And when I tried this uh, Seymour Duncan overdrive pedal, which is called the 805 Overdrive, um, it was the best sound that I've ever heard. And uh, that has to do with a couple things on the pedal. And uh, one is the uh, three band equalizer you get with it, the bass, middle, and tre treble control that you have right on it. That's very, very unique to this pedal. That's something that I wish a handful of other pedals uh, had, but, but they don't. I tend to use the drive control about two thirds of the way up. And what I love about that is it, it really has some power and some crunch but you can still hear the chord tones, which is obviously really important, especially in country music. So let me show you a couple of uh, couple ways I can do this. I, uh, I always tend to keep my treble and uh, my mid boost a little bit higher on it, just because it cuts through the sound a little better. Um, and like I say, it's, I literally use it on every song, so that's, that's important as a lead guitarist to be able to, to get yourself above the mix like that. So I've got the level here about a third of the way up, and I've got the drive uh, two thirds of the way up, and this is, my, this is my favorite position to play it. I'm playing this through a, uh, uh, my favorite Reverend Telecaster with a set of Seymour Duncan uh, Antiquity Tele pickups, uh, and I'm using the clean channel on my Mesa Boogie Lone Star amp, uh, which is a, a beautiful sound. So here's the clean sound. So that's the clean sound. I'm gonna go ahead and turn this thing on here. Bridge pickup and give it a little bite, which is great for leads. This is my absolute favorite tone to solo with, so. And then I'm gonna play it here if you really crank the drive and uh, get this thing singing a little bit. Uh, I'll play it in both pickup positions, but you can hear that it, it really starts to really starts to sing. And then uh, lastly, my uh, sound that I use a lot uh, where I back the drive way off. And uh, I'll just kind of give you an idea here. This is, a, this is a clean tone here. And then if you just push a little bit of punch on top of it. It's great because you can hit chords and still really hear the chord tones come out in there. 